and welcome to the tutorial on how to install SPSS by Stat Modeler. So let's get started. So go to google.com, there you can search IBM SPSS software download or you can visit the link given in the description. First link that you are getting, just click on that. So here due to Corona, uh, the SPSS has extended its trial to June 15 instead of 30 days trial. So you can just click on the try free through June 15. Here it will be asking for your details, so you can mention your detail, your email ID, first name, password. Please remember this password because it will be required for using later. So let me uh, fill my details. You can select your country and all, then click on the next. You can select whether you are student or professional, so click on the student. And you can also select whether you want to be contacted by IBM business partner for special student pricing or not. Let me click on the no and then I can enter my phone number. Click on the next. So it has sent verification email to my email ID. I have to enter that seven digit code in this verification talk. So let me enter that. And then you can select your preference like how you would like to get updated information from the IBM. So you can click on by email or by telephone, whatever you want. Let me click on the create account. These are the standard terms and conditions that you can view and then you can click on the process. It may take some of the time to create your account. So once this page is loaded, you can click on the download button here below the IBM SPSS statistics subscription trial. Once you click on the download, it will give you some information about the trial and paid subscription. And if you scroll down, then it is displaying the minimum system requirement. So you must have this much of system configuration to install this on your laptop or PC. And then you can select your system is whether 32 bits or 64 bit. So mine is 64 bits. So let me click on the download for Windows 64 bit. Once I click on the download for Windows 64 bits, it will start downloading. It is a setup of 538 megabytes, so it may take time. So let me pause the video and once it is downloaded, let us start the installation process. So once it is downloaded, you can just click on the setup. When it asks for the setup, you can click on yes. Depending upon the speed and configuration of your system, it may take a time because it is a heavy software. So once you see this kind of dialog box at that time you should click on I agree and then continue. So it is showing the path where this program will be installed. So by default path would be C drive program files. So you don't need to do anything over here but if you want to install this program somewhere else in some other drive then you can click on choose and select your path. It will take 1.5 GB of storage space. So click on the continue. So once you click on the continue it, it will start installing the software. It may take a while. So once the installation is completed, you can get this kind of window. And then you can either click on done or you can click on the launch to open the software. Once it is open, it will ask you to sign into the IBM account. So please remember those email ID and password which you use to create a free trial account. So let me enter that. You can click on the remember to avoid each and every time entering this IBM ID and password and then click on the continue it will ask for the password so enter the password that you created so it is a welcome window of IBM SPSS from here you can create a new data set or open some other file which is already stored in your PC you can also close this so it will automatically open a new file so here it is so our SPSS trial version has been successfully installed. Now you can use it till the trial period is over. Thank you for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe to our channel and share it with your friends. Thank you. Thank you so much.